वेलकम बैक टू अवर चैनल एंड इन टुडेस वीडियो व्हाट आर वी डूइंग वी आर गोइंग टू बी मेकिंग अ केक बट नॉट जस्ट एनी केक एनी केक वी आर मेकिंग अ टू डी टी फ्रूटी केक विदाउट फायर अगेन सिंस यू गाइस लव आवर ओरियो केक विदाउट फायर वी आर एडिंग समथिंग न्यू टू द विदाउट फायर सीरीज राइट या या सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड सो द इंग्रेडिएंट्स यू वुड नीड इज अ मेदा ऑल पर्पस फ्लावर वन cup and 1/4 cup and you would need milk powder yes half cup of milk powder oh. yeah and what is this vanilla essence yes one teaspoon one teaspoon of vanilla, vanilla essence vanilla essence and you would need a uh, one milk. a half cup plus 1/4 cup of milk. milk and you would also need one cup of powdered Brand sugar powdered sugar yeah. yes and you would need baking powder and baking soda so you would need one teaspoon of baking powder and uh, you will need 1 and 1/2 teaspoon of baking, of baking soda. soda okay so uh, what is this oil we need oil 2 tablespoons of two oil tablespoons of oil and then the main thing two di fruit two di fruit is the pretty two di fruit is if you guys don't have then you can totally cut off that and then you can have your vanilla, vanilla cake. cake but this is the two di fruit magic of today's recipe yes And we have also taken a spatula and a whisk and a, a bowl and, bowl. and, and also bowl. a sieve. Sorry, not sieve. All our dry ingredients. So let's start by sieving our dry ingredients. So first, let's add the maida. Yeah. So how much of this maida? I have used one fourth cup plus uh, one cup. Yeah. One fourth cup plus one cup of maida. Yes. Next, we are gonna add. Uh, and then next, we are gonna add milk, milk powder. powder. Half cup of milk powder. Yeah. If you don't uh, have milk powder, then you can use even curd. use curd. Half cup of curd. Yeah. But of course, you have to use it in the wet ingredients. And then baking powder and baking soda. Yeah. You can so mix it. it, and then a uh, uh, one cup add. of powdered sugar. Yes. So add all of that. Add it. So come. Oh uh, yeah. That is done. So Now you just gotta sieve it. Let me yeah. remove all of that with a spatula. <laughs> Okay, now yeah. you just have to save it. Here you go. You can do. Uh, we are done saving our dry ingredients. So now we have to whisk them. So yes, whisk. whisk the dry ingredients until it's well combined. So these are our dry ingredients. Now we just have to whisk it. Yes. Here you can whisk it. Okay, so that's done. Now it's time to add our wet ingredients. So by the way, guys, I will you know, uh, link this recipe in and the description the, box. All the measurements, measurements and everything. everything. Yes. So first, we are gonna add uh, milk. Yes, milk. So let's add the milk, which will make gradually, it. guys. Add the milk gradually, and the milk will make our batter a batter. Who's not drying? Yes. Now you can whisk it. Add a little by little, guys. Don't add all of it at once. Okay, so add some more. Okay. And now just add the whole thing. Okay. So now you can uh, always use a spatula also. Okay. So now I'm gonna add vanilla, vanilla essence. essence. Mix it. So okay. that it, it it gives some flavor to it. Yeah. So guys, now you have to make your batter lump free. So uh, now we are mixing it. Now after mi mixing it, guys, we can add the oil. Yeah. We're gonna yeah. add this in the last two tablespoons of oil. Whisk it. Then add it some more, some more, and then just add the whole thing. Now so nice. whisk this again. We'll be right back. Okay, guys. So we are done mixing the batter, and, and it is lump all free. lump free. And there are no air bubbles, as you can see. Okay, now it's time to add the tutti frutti. So this is the tutti frutti, guys. And this, this is optional. Gives your batter color, and this is our secret ingredient. Yes. Okay. So let's. And they're really yummy. Come on, you can even you can add. Also, these are healthy. 
cute cakes. Guys, look at the color. If you wow. guys only want to make a vanilla uh, cake, you then can you can skip these. the tutti frutti and just make a vanilla cake. Look at how. I'm just gonna add a little bit more. Okay, now like again, just mix it. Mix it until then, until that time, uh, I'm mixing. You can grease the pan with some oil yes. and like a brush to uh, grease. So you can grease it. So uh, make sure you wait, uh, wait, so wait. the pan I'm using is uh, seven inch by seven inch, and make sure you even grease the, the sides. Side. Otherwise, uh, it's gonna the cake is gonna stick to the oil. Yes, if you don't grease it with oil. Or you can even uh, grease it with, with butter. With butter, yes. I'm gonna pour oil all, all over the edges, as you can see. Yes, and all over the edges, so that it can come out easily. And your batter should be like a flowy consistency, guys. Look, that should be the consistency of your batter. There we go. Nice and rich. Okay, done. Right. So now it's time for us to add the batter. So for the ba adding the batter, I'm going to use a silicone spatula. First we should fold yes. the batter. So and fold and turn the bowl. I know. Okay. So first you're going to go under and then over and then turn the bowl. Then the next time, under, over and turn. Turn the bowl. That's how you fold and then you can scrape down the sides. Yes. That's why you should use silicone spatulas so that you can get all the batter out. Bowl. Okay, now let's add it into our tin. So, okay, so we're just gonna add it in. You can uh, move the spatula. Look, yeah, yeah, yeah. do it. Push it. Hold the bowl and just add it. So, we're gonna get all of uh, this our batter out. And yeah, we can. Okay, so we are done pouring batter in our tin. This is look how pretty it looks. It looks like a fun fatty cake. Okay, guys. So now uh, put your oven on microwave to preheat for 180 degrees. And then you can put your cake in mm. there for 15 to 20 minutes. And, and then it will bake. Yes. So guys, we are yeah. back. And the cake is done yeah. now. And, and it, so it looks so good, guys. Look. Look at it. Now we are gonna cut it. Let's cut so it. Excited. So wait, before we cut the cake, I yes. need to tell them the do's and don'ts. Okay guys, so the do's is, if you're using milk powder, then make sure you only use of Amul or Amulia because I have tried that Nestle actually doesn't work. And the don'ts are that you shouldn't use <laughs> Nestle. Nestle. And when you are, if you are using curd, then the curd should be put in with the wet ingredients and not with the dry ingredients. So these are the do's and don'ts. Do make sure to follow these. Okay, now, now let's, let's cut, cut it. Okay, come on. Yeah. You want to take? Woo! Yay! Look, you guys can see the tutti frutti, it looks so good. And yeah, let's cut it. Now, let's taste it. Let me cut myself. It is so good, guys. It is mm, delicious. It's really good. It's I love it. And it's so pretty. Look, and all the tutti frutti inside. Mm, it just gives it a different, uh, different flavor. Guys, this is so tasty. Do try it out. And if you guys like it, share it with your friends. And yes, this was another recipe of the Without Fire series. Yes, guys. So if you guys like, like this video, don't here forget you to... go, guys. Have some. If you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And yes, comment and subscribe to our channel. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.